Our hope is that young people come away from here realizing the strength of our democracy and of our and that it begins with them. This strength begins in our homes, it fosters in our schools, and is reflected in our fellow citizens and in the leadership of this community. We hope young people read the pavers on these walkways whose predominant themes are the importance and remembrance of family, the dedication and service to our communities by our first responders, and the selfless service, commitment, and sacrifice for our country by those who served in our nation's armed forces. The memorial in Kewaskum will become an important place for those future gen generations who will come to learn of and appreciate the sacrifices of 9-11 and to celebrate those strengths which make up the fabric of our communities, our state, and our country. Our hope it will, is it will become a destination location for school and veterans groups and for those visitors who wish to reflect and learn about a day in history which altered the future of our country. All assembled here today have contributed in making this Wisconsin 9-11 Memorial a place of reflection, a place of education, and a touchstone linking future visitors to that past event. This special place would not exist without you and the hundreds of community members who have believed in, funded, and volunteered your expertise, your time, materials, and labor to build this incredible monument. And as we gather here on the Wisconsin 9-11 Memorial Highway, our deep appreciation for the leadership of Congressman Scott Fitzgerald, State Senator Dewey Strobel, and State Representative Timothy Rantham, and my good friend Ethan Hallenberger, who were instrumental in the naming of this highway as well as the leadership of the village of Kiwaska, Washington County, and of the great state of Wisconsin, who have shared our belief and vision. This memorial would not have been possible without your support. This is a place of remembrance. And this is a place of hope. This is a place of celebration. On behalf of the Board of Directors of Kewaskum Remembers 9-11, past and present, thank you for creating this beautiful memorial for our community, our county, and our state. Our all-volunteer board and committee deserve my thanks and gratitude. They are an incredibly talented team whose passion for this project has made it a reality. Throughout the years, they have kept us true to our mission statement, which is to build and sustain a 9-11 memorial to remember the victims, honor those who responded, celebrate the resilience of our communities and country, and educate future generations. I thank all of you. I would like to express my love and admiration to my supportive family. Confronted with the loss of our dear Andrea almost 20 years ago, Kathy, Julie, and Andrea's fiance, Al Kalata, have faced many challenges, yet we have faced them together. They and my grandchildren, little Mia and Gordon and son-in-law Troy, are the source of my strength and resolve. Thank you. Never forget, God bless America, keep us strong. Thank you. <laughs>